a lot of potential young Hollywood couples really, you know, things are brewing, but it's early in the year. So we don't know what's going to what's going to pan out. Well, Sarah Huron, there is a hot new hookup that I know that you have been thinking about nonstop because it involves your queen of opening expensive presents around Christmas time and former and, you know, queen of overcoming college admission scandals, Olivia Jade. Tell us about our hot new hookup and just, you know, any news you want to share on Olivia Jade because you know more than your average Joe. Oh, I got an Olivia Jade update for you. A few things. One, she finally acknowledged that everyone has been asking her to bring back the luxury Christmas hauls on TikTok. And she was like, never again. Like she was like, no. And I was like, Olivia, like there was a lot. I have been tweeting that for like three years. People really got on board this year, um, wanting her to bring back the luxury hauls. And she addressed it on TikTok and said, I will never do that again. And I think that that is just upsetting, Olivia. It do sort your of makes duty. sense though. I mean, well, she of course got, it'd like... be in poor taste, but <laughs> it is what, that's what we want from her. I'm not a yes. stan of Olivia Jade because I actually like believe in her. Um, yeah. But you know who might? Jacob Elordi yes. of Euphoria fame. Um, the two of them were spotted out together in Los Angeles grabbing coffee. Um, the same day that Kaya Gerber was spotted out with, um, what's his name? I can't remember. <laughs> yeah. Um, but her ex, so Jacob Elordi and Kaya Gerber dated for like a year. Um, they broke up and she, he is now hanging out with Olivia Jade. A source tells us that um, it's casual. They're keeping it casual, but they've been on some dates. Um, obviously, they both got out of relationships recently, so they're not rushing into anything serious. So far, it's just sparks between them. Um, so very exciting for Olivia Jade. Obviously, um, Jacob Elordi is like kind of a big deal. Um, and Euphoria's coming back. Yeah, Euphoria is coming back. I assume they probably would like matched on an app or like he reached out to her. Um, I don't know. It's 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 definitely very an interesting potential duo. Olivia also had a new podcast episode come out today, which you know is something I'm very in tune to, tapped into conversations with Olivia Jade. And she was talking about misconceptions about her. And she said, there's a big misconception about me, at least personally, where I get the comment of, you don't work hard. I didn't have to start my YouTube when I was 14. I put in a lot of work. There's all these rumors floating around about my grades. Quote, she clearly didn't work hard. She must've failed school. I don't think I've ever said this publicly, but in high school, I had straight A's and I worked really hard. <laughs> How about rowing? Yeah. How about rowing, Olivia Jade? Did you row? <laughs> Were you a rower? It's possible. <laughs> I, I'm sure she thinks she works very hard and does a lot of things. It's made her famous. I'm not trying to take away from her accomplishments that most people do in their free time, but there I said it. Yeah. Oh, um, by the way, it was Austin Butler who Kaya Gerber was was spotted with. I couldn't leave. Thank you. I couldn't remember. I couldn't either. either. And that's a Hutchins ex and star yes. of the new Elvis movie. A lot of potential young Hollywood couples really, you know, things are brewing, but it's early in the year. So we don't know what's going to what's going to pan out. Well, we do know that they will change. 